scenario to me. So yeah. there are a lot of, and I get to hear that a lot from ladies. So, oh, you, you and Long John, you know, you've known each other from senior high school, yeah. uh, uh, university. Now you are. Oh, so, oh, Long John. Oh, that, that, that is the Long risk. John. That is the risk. I mean, Long John, me, damn, brother, sister, vi. So, oh, but that is what I was. Oh, oh, nah, it's it will break the you know brother sister vibe we have. So, you know, I have somebody that I've been you know for three months. They downplay that particular one more. Yeah. Because it's brother sister vibe. You yes. don't get that. I, I get that. Uh -huh. Most I've, I've I've been through that before. So you see oh. Yes, but <laughs> but if you follow trends mm -hmm. now, you realize that there are um people that call themselves my brother, my sister, but they ended up married. Are they not few? Yeah, we have lots of them. Lots of them. You just don't hear them say, This my brother, this my mm. sister. Yes. But there are some people that if a lady doesn't like you. Shoe brothers don't knew immediately. Mm. Yes. But if she likes you, no matter people saying you guys are um, are siblings, no, he's um, he's your brother, you are his sister, mm -hmm. you look beyond that. And one of the mistakes we make is just putting them in that bracket. Mm. You put them in that bracket and you, you restrict yourself from knowing them the more. Mm. Trust me, I would prefer somebody I've been in secondary school with, I know the person, I know the person's flaws, everything, before dating the person. That would be a go-to for me, the first thing. If I know you for a long time, I know that, oh, you might be a brother. Why do I believe Enam is speaking now because she has learnt lessons over the period? <laughs> she wouldn't guess. be saying this <laughs> if it were. experience is talking. I'm telling but there's you. a risk in the choice she wants to make. Okay. The risk is that we've heard stories, we've seen people mm -hmm. where uh, me and this girl there and uh, she go yeah, marry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You understand? So if you're in a relationship... A lot of them. Yes. yes. So make your intentions known as quickly as possible. Else you'll feel sad line, you'll feel used. They'll drop you. This girl used me, uh, then she go marry somebody. But you two, you mm. use me, uh, you, you, you go marry so there, somebody. There's a risk in there. It might work for somebody, mm. but it might not work for the other person. For me, make your intentions known as mm. quickly as possible. If you have intentions and they are clear intentions. But do you know that there know. are some guys that they will be with you, but they wouldn't make their intentions known? They like you. Because you are brother zone the party. I will, no. <laughs> <laughs> I like that, I will lie. Give me the And, 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 and I, will ask, I, will, I want to ask, how long does he want to date you secretly before coming out? No, you see, you see, that is why you need to understand whoever you are with. Okay. Mm -hmm. Be it friendship or be it relationship. Yes, Some people are timid. Sorry for using that word. Some people are timid. They, they can't express themselves. But you, the lady or the guy, should see all the green lights. The same way you're in a relationship and you see red flags, you should be able to see those green lights. Okay. I'm not saying that um, they can't do that, but you know, some, some guys are intimidated by ladies, mm -hmm. the way they are. Mm -hmm. I mean, per person, but the, the, the way you are, mm. I, I keep asking myself, if I move forward, will she accept me? Mm. Will she not? And would you, you know? break that? Break? Because you see, again, there's been a lot of time. So we, we are going to open the phone lines. The question I'm asking is, have you had an experience with someone who says, you are just like my brother or my sister, and then they left you rather, went to get married to someone, now they are back, and oh, I made a exactly. mistake. Or better still, have you broken up with someone because... You shared a brother-sister vibe with the person, and you went forward to propose and say, ah, you, you are in the brother zone now, you are even off everything zone. Call us, let us know what you think about the topic, and whether or not you have had this experience. <laughs> have you had the experience before where you, were, you felt like, no, Charlie, this is the vibe, I'm, and then you went ahead and like, nah. Oh, unfortunately, mine was not a good one. Okay. Tell I me went about ahead it. and, <laughs> you, know, you know, when you get closer to people, mm -hmm. there are certain parameters you get in, mm -hmm. you get to know a lot of things about people. Yes. You get to know their flaws. Mm -hmm. yeah. And mine was that the lady was quick, quick, quick tempered. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah. At the point, she couldn't even break a glass of water in my presence. Hey. I was like, wow. Hey, senior. Don't venture, you'll die early. That can, <laughs> it can destroy an economy. So I, I imagine if she was holding a knife. Yeah. yeah. Just yeah. one statement. Yeah. You understand? So I was mine was a bad one. Okay. But somebody might get a good one of right, course. With right, that. Yeah. Right. For me, the thing is, as early as possible, if mm -hmm. you love me, mm -hmm. make it known. Mm -hmm. If you want us to date, make it known. Mm -hmm. If you are dating me secretly, you think I'm okay with you, mm -hmm. then make it known. Okay. The, but there must be friendliness. Okay. The friendship must be there. We must we must vibe. We okay. must understand each other. Mm. We must be able to understand uh, the future, what we, we, our plans are, I see. what we intend to do. Then comes to my question now to say that me 
maybe all of this whole thing about friendship is a fluke. I say this because 